I found something out recently that completely blew me away. This is something so massively revolutionary to my, my whole thinking about property. I'm just, I'm, I'm gobsmacked. This is about right to buy. If you have a right to buy on a house, you cannot not watch this video. If you have a right to buy on a house and you don't watch this video, or if you know someone that has one, or if you know someone that might have one and you don't watch this video, you deserve to be punched in the face and you deserve to be broke for the rest of your life, okay? Let me explain something, okay? This right to buy is when you've lived in a house, the house is a council house, and you've been renting this house. If you're renting a council house or a council flat, maybe in London or whatever, the council give you a right to buy the house and they have a discount. This is being banned, by the way. This has been scrapped. They've scrapped this in Scotland. They're scrapping this in Wales. This is just in England right now. You have the option, the right, the op not the obligation, but the option to buy the house at a discount. The longer you've lived in the house, maybe you already know this part. This isn't the shocking part. It gets shocking in a minute. The longer you've lived in the house, the more you can get the house discounted. So if you've lived in the house like 10 years, I don't know, maybe you get like a 50% discount. I've met so many people that say, oh, I've got this council flat in London. It's worth 200 grand. I've got the option to buy it for 90 grand. I'm like, what? You can buy it 50% or more below market value? What are you doing then? Go ahead and buy it. And they say this, they say, I ain't got the money. I haven't got the money to buy it. And I'm like, okay, can't you find the money? Samuel is tough, man. I, I'm a, right. However, this is what I found out recently. This changes everything. There are lenders out there. Okay, there are lenders that will let you use the discount as the deposit. Do you understand what that means? That means that if you have a house that's worth 200 grand and you've got the right to buy, you've got the right to buy it for a 150 grand, just 50 grand discount. There are lenders that will let you use the discount. They'll let you use the discount as the deposit. Meaning that if you've got a right to buy, you can just buy the house for nothing. <laughs> and people are sitting on their right to buy houses thinking I can't afford it. There was one lady I met recently. I met a lady. She said, I can't afford it. I introduced her to my mortgage lending broker who said, we can just put the discount as the deposit. A quick one, so let's do my Saturday. I'm just sat with um, some, some uh, it's a student of mine. She's got um, a property. It's basically, it's a, it, she's got the right to buy it. It's a, um, she's lived in it for 11 years. It's a council house. It's worth 180,000 pounds, but she's got the right to buy it for 67,500. Okay. So I've told her just to just buy it and stop messing around and get it like now. Um, yeah. Question: have you, do, you, do you do mortgages for properties like that? Oh yeah, oh no, yeah. Good. What kind of deposit, generally speaking? I mean, she's in full-time work and stuff. The salary is twenty-five thousand. Twenty-five thousand. Yeah. 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 Twenty-five
but with right to buy, they'll let you use the discount as the deposit. What? Also with right to buy, you don't have to live in it. You can rent it out. It doesn't have to be a new build or there's, there's, it's not like the help to buy all these restrictions. As long as you don't sell it straight away, if you wait five years, you can sell it, cash in. Yippee! You can refinance it. You can use the deposit as the, the discount as the deposit. So the only thing that you have to pay for is the legal fees, which might be a grand or two. And the, the, this lady I was with recently, she said, I can't even afford the legal fees. I said, if you can't even afford the legal fees and you're prepared to walk away from a house, let me put the money in for the legal fees. Like, I don't care if it's a loan or if it's a gift, just let me put the money in. And I'm, I'm gonna say this right now as well to you. If you know someone who's got a right to buy, but they can't buy it, even though they can use the discount as the deposit, but they're so freaking broke that they can't buy it because they can't afford the legal fees, hit me up on Instagram, I'll put the freaking money in. I'll just put the money in, okay? Because I'm not having people walking away from free houses because they can't afford the legal fees. It's just crazy. So share this video all across London. Share this with your friends and family and let everybody with a right to buy discount that can't buy it because they can't put the legal fees in, let me put that money down, okay? Because I'm just, I'm dying here. Because what's gonna happen is when they don't buy the property, and the right to buy finishes or expires or whatever, or they move out and move on, they're gonna look back for the whole rest of their lives and kick themselves. So hit me up, let me know now, let me put that money in. Share this video around, man. Let, let, let's, get some, let's get some people buying some houses this year. Let's get that done this year. I might have to take this video down soon if I get too many people messaging me um, in the next day or two. So get this shared fast with your loved ones. Let's make some stuff happen. Wow.